<laughs> do it again. Do it again. I'm fuck. We'll do the fucking other thing. We'll do the other thing later. All right, so wh wh how me and Crew decided we wanted to start off this podcast was is that somebody somebody at random would be chosen and they get to insult everyone and that's their introduction to the podcast. Like say like. Okay, you ready? Kawiska, you look like um you just I don't even know. Fuck yeah, I was gonna say. Bro, the vaccine is fucking my brain, bro. It's fucked. Oh, I can't do That's this. That's how we start this off. Is we're talking about politics, politics, shit. Oh my god. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Trump. <laughs> okay, wait there, wait there, wait there. Okay, let me, let me think. Let me, give me let, me, let me think. Let me think. Let me I think. Can, I can do. We can just do an intro. I know. Like, one of okay. us could just make one up on the spot. Yeah, here's Kawiska, the world's favorite Mexican. Woo woo. <laughs> uh, better? I should get my tacos. Get my tacos. All that's going in, by the way. All of this is going in. It's all. I've been recording for the last minute and a half. I've been recording for the last fourteen minutes. So oh, fuck. Fifteen actually. Uh, Sixteen. Fuck you all. Oh my God. Wow. Never. Dang dang. Such a try hard. For those of you who don't know, Blade has pretty much has no room in his computer because he has recorded everything from the past like six months. Factual. I've recorded absolutely to... nothing for the last six months. I've been AFK and I don't even know how these people are showing my friends. <laughs> He's been away from <laughs> keyboard. He's been away from keyboard. No That's big deal. My my I checked it the other day because I was wor I was worried um how big it was getting. That's what she said. Um it, yeah, it's one point four one terabytes. My my YouTube folder, personal YouTube folder. Terabytes? I even work terabytes. How much storage do you have? Oh, I have like four uh, oh, six shoot, shoot. No, 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 yeah, the terabytes, the terabytes, terabytes scared me. I have two terabytes. I have a two terabyte hard drive. I did uh, oh, terabytes. Shit. I thought was above terabytes. That's what I, was gonna <laughs> I thought terabytes was above terabytes. What, what's the one? What's the one after? What's, what's that called? This is so like, retarded. Terabytes. I have one Pentabyte, terabyte yeah. in my hand. I have two in my. I actually have like four of my PC, but I have like. Who just one has that head. laying on the desk? I got a fake plant laying on my desk. I have. Condoms. I have a CPU. <laughs> I was gonna say I if you pulled that, if you, if you pulled out like a box of condoms, I would have been like, "Fuck!" Now I gotta blow the ads. No, I've used them all. <laughs> oh. Jesus. Oh. oh my god, dude, that's nice how we're starting this off. All right. Um, but for those of you who are wondering, um, why? Because I, I had mentioned this in a video before, but me and Crewhead had made all the social medias for this. The reason why we didn't do this at like. The time we were supposed to is that somebody was AFK working at Walmart's. Him. It, it, oh wait. Uh, other way. Other direction. Yo, no, no, direction. no. I know. I know. Right. It's like I'm, like, right. well, I'm well, looking at OBS. I'm looking at OBS. <laughs> I'm looking at OBS because like, it's all like different directions. Everything's it's flipped. Like right there for me. Every actually, I just realized everything's opposite of what you are. Everything's opposite of what you're seeing right now. I'm in the top right corner, even though I'm in the bottom right of Discord. I never remembered it. Yeah, and then Blade's right down, right here, and then Kawiska's right under me, and I'm and I'm like top left. <laughs> you, that's Kawiska. Uh, you should be going up a little bit more. Oh, okay. I get. I thought you were going for me. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Uh, oh my gosh. What's been going on? What's uh? I have questions, but I just like I want to pull them up first because I was bro, not playing for this. I've got I've got something something ex like weird happened to me today like okay. you, can call it, you can call it whatever you want so i was i've been trying to switch to the day shift for the longest time because uh -huh. i can't i can't be going to night shift until seven o'clock in the morning and then going to school at seven o'clock in the morning and then going to practice at, at 4 30 in the afternoon like there is no time for me to sleep right there right yeah that would suck so ass. i've been trying to switch but for some freaking reason they have one chick that decides that decides how who's who does what on their schedule so this just happened to be the two weeks that she was on vacation. And I was, I've been complaining about it constantly. But before that, about like four days before she left, I met this chick that she was, she normally works on the day shift and she works out in the garden area. And it was too hot that day for her to work. So she decides to work the night shift that day. So I join her, or I, I don't join her, but I'm joining my, my maintenance crew. We're all talking and uh, discussing during our break. And she comes over and she's asked uh, like the main guy, our main maintenance guy. She was like, "Hey, can you do this?" And he just laughs at her. And I was like, "What the heck? Why? Like, what the heck?" I thought he was joking. And then she's like, "Can you?" And he's like, "No, I'll do what I want." And I look at her. I'm like, "Don't worry, I'll get it. I got trash today, anyways." And she needed to pick up some trash outside. And she was like, "Oh, thank you." 
And so I go and do the trash. And when I go out there, she's out there and we start talking and she's really nice. I didn't think anything of it. So I leave. And that was, that was that today, actually, I was talking to her and I was like, Hey, do you know where the boss lady is? And she was like, if she's not in today, she's not coming in today. I was like, are you gotta be kidding me? And she was like, why? And I was like, I really got to switch to day shift. And she looks at me. She's like, I'll take you. And I was like, okay. <laughs> so I got, because I decided to pick up the trash for her two, three weeks ago, she, she helped me out and hooked me up with the day shift time. See, that's more evidence of like, I always do this thing where it's like, uh, even if I don't feel like doing it, I'll do it just because like I could do it. And, it, and like, I feel like yeah. s- eventually it would like help me down the line. But um, Bro, any- it's weird how that stuff works. Like, yeah, yeah. Anything. The smallest things. The smallest thing. Oh yeah. Anything else from anybody else, Blade? I know you're not on a zucchini or whatever it is, or a cucumber. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you ate a zucchini raw, I think I'd be a little I'm mad at you, hungry, bro. You fucking idiot. It's... So, so for, for me right now, it's twenty to twelve in the middle of the night. If you can't tell, so I'm fucking hungry, bro. <laughs> but um, no, it's been super chill. Um. Waiting for my mum to give birth, which is a fucking pain in my ass. So every second I look at my phone like this, I'm like, oh, mum texts me. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> well, like, so I'm on call constantly. It's pissing me off. But hey, that's my life. Yeah, well, if anybody doesn't know, Blade shows up to like one out of three sessions every other week because he's been gone for like the past. He's been on and off, which I'm not mad at him imagine, for. Out of the month. I'm, I'm not mad, mad at him for it because only, he's been moving out. He's moving Imagine out, so. To... <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Imagine, imagine <laughs> actually showing, showing up. up. Imagine <laughs> showing up, man. Um, but yeah, but um, I'm glad. I'm glad. Um, Blade's actually getting, being able to move out because he's told me before he's he's excited to move out. Um, crew. Yeah, that, yeah, that's all in the works. Crew? I have no storage here. That's my. That's everything of mine. That's to be fair. There's an animal crate that I need to get rid of. But... You said you were moving into a different apartment, though. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Well then, yeah. At least you should have space to put shit. My panels yeah. are even sideways. It's that fucked. <laughs> I'm hoping so. I I might have one whole room to myself for screaming. Nice. I'm yeah. hoping I do. Yeah. That's what I want to do. That'd that's what I want to have. That, that's like every person's dream is just to have their own streaming room, especially yeah. for like gamers like that. I just but, uh, I just don't like having it in my room. It makes yeah. me like it, it feels it's a weird feeling. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, uh, it feels weird. It's uh, um with me, it's always just the fact that like if I'm up late like at night editing or even playing even, and I can look behind me and there's my bed and I can literally just go over there and I can't tell you how many times I've been like, oh yeah, I'll just lay there on my phone for a little bit, take like a little break, and it's like seven a.m. in like the next minute, and I'm like, fuck, and so that. yeah, I overslept for school, blah blah blah, blah. but yeah, uh, crew still fat. Uh. No, uh, yeah, normal. <laughs> no. Normal. Another day, another seven pussies pounded. Don't worry. <laughs> That's bullshit. More like seven <laughs> cheeseburgers ate, you little shit. Oh, damn. Damn. I don't like cheeseburgers. Cats do not count. I know you're you like hit like cheese the corner, bro. The fat guy wait, out of the group doesn't wait. like cheeseburgers. Wait, Explain, cheeseburgers? motherfucker. No, there's we need so a, many I mean, things. Like, there's so many things I'd rather eat than a cheeseburger. Like, if I'm going to indulge in like something nice, like a nice meal, like a nacho fajita. Like that's some great shit, that's bro. Nice wait, wait, what is happening right now? Yeah, I got you. <laughs> that that's some nice shit right there. Okay. <laughs> God. Okay. I don't. I don't know. That that I like, no, I'll I take like a burger. Tea, yeah, I'm the same. I like a good cheeseburger where the cheese nice and melted, the meat's fresh and it's good meat. It's not cheap meat. It's flat yeah, yeah, packed yeah. like McDonald's. I feel that. I, I like a McDonald's, but you, you know, like, like proper patties, meat. You know, like actual like ground meat, not frozen patties. Yeah, like proper proper meat that has got some love, some care in it. It's had some seasoning in it. Some some big guys some slapped a bunch of meat. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like me. You know what I mean? Like mm, mm, that good one. Mm. Every now and again, we'll shut off just randomly and just be a black screen. Oh, that's awesome, that dude! Perfect time, bro. <laughs> oh, I don't give a shit if I peaked my mic there. That was awesome. Just ah, oh, shit. Just, <laughs> oh, fuck me, dude. It was okay. that's awesome. That, that's a- Back to the cheese, like some good cheese. I can't fucking focus, bro. Some like good cheese, a good bun, not like a shit bun. Like oh, I mean, a good bun that's cheese? been grilled good. 
It de- it depends because each burger can have different cheese. Like I feel that. Mo- most of the time, it's like you know, like the American sliced cheese that can mm-hmm. sometimes hit. Sometimes it doesn't. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 depends on the burger. And oh, I found this local takeaway place that does like the best fucking burgers. They take so much care of their burgers. It even comes in like foil wrapping. Which it keeps the oh, burger warm until places. you get to it. Oh, it's so good, bro. How can you not love a cheese? You're thinking burger? of Five Guys, aren't you, Quiska? Me? Five, yeah, I've Five never Guys. Been to five Guys, actually. Really? Damn. I want to no, go. We have one in the UK. I want to go. Uh, I want to go too. We have one near where I where I moved in. Yeah. Uh, no, I have a Five Guys where I where I live near too, and like they're not the best burgers, but at the same time, it's like it's always easier to like order from like because my family orders a lot of DoorDash and stuff like that. I'm not saying that like we're ordering it every time. Like we go out to eat a lot, but um we're still ordering it and like the the it's way easier to do that rather than have like a hot burger rather than like order from like McDonald's and have like a frozen solid burger pretty much or a stale burger. Yo, McDonald's in America sounds horrific. It just sounds like a pile of grease, like crew. Like McDonald's <laughs> over here is like the like me. It's like lean. It's got a bit of meat to it, and it's not greasy. If you know what I mean. Like over here, burgers are like the burgers are really like quite fresh. They're still flat pack burgers basically, but they're a lot fresher than what the fuck Americans sound like. I don't eat Yours burgers. Just sounds like grease. I don't eat burgers from McDonald's. Like I I, I, I used to. Chicken, I like the chicken sandwiches. The chicken like, sandwiches are pretty good. Dude, I yeah, literally they, I, only eat the chicken nuggets. That's it. Like oh, that's the, the only thing I eat. Like oh, the yo, twenty the piece chicken nuggets from... is always the best. Nugget, nugget I'm sad it's not a meal. It pisses me off that it's not a meal. I don't know. You don't if have a meal. You don't have a nuggy meal. We have a nuggy meal, but it's only nine nuggets. What the fuck are you going to do with nine nuggets? Bro, I could shit more than that. Hey, crew, you could... I think we have a nine nugget meal, and I think we have a 20 nugget meal. Is hey, bro, whack up. Fat people, bro. <laughs> one second, one second. I just need to take care of something. Crew, you could just say that out loud. You don't have to text yeah, me. Yeah, you guys were in the middle of a conversation. Well, no, fuck. here's the thing, crew, is that I went to click on that and I fucked up the overlay. Like, it's not that bad, but like, <laughs> don't, like, you, you could say it out loud, man. It's not that big of a deal. What's going on? Well, no, he sent me a text. He sent me a DM because he didn't want to like interrupt the podcast because he wanted he, see, he wanted to see if he wanted to move move us down to the podcast chat. Um, if you could do me a favor, Blade, can you just at everyone and say uh, we're doing the podcast and lobby? Because the, be... the only per- the only person that was going to join was Vic, and Vic just text me, "Are you recording?" And I said yes. Okay, well, yeah, then, there she you go. Me too. That, then that's perfect. Then I don't think anybody else will do that. Well, that, no, that's no, one, no one else will join it. If they do, we we'll just tell them. Uh, I just yeah. set a limit to yeah. it to four people, so it'll perfect. Be just okay. There we go. Yeah, that's uh, why uh, I like having. We're the only people with uh with the uh, privileges on this. <laughs> uh, that that Canadian chicken dude does, but like he's he's like if you ever need anything, like if I'm out of town and like these guys can't do it or you guys can't do it, uh, he'll he'll indefinitely do whatever I need him to. He's He's like an intern, pretty much for me. So um. Okay, okay. I, I I've got a question. Yeah. Because in England we have so many takeaways and like places you can go to get food is unreal. Like mm-hmm. so many non-chain restaurants. I can go on my phone right now and get like two hundred restaurants up and get it delivered to my door. What is your like go-to restaurant? Oh. Chain or non-chain? That is a it good. Doesn't matter which. That is a good question. Like, do you like? When you say like okay. restaurant, do you mean like million dollar company or like a small? No, no, he's, a, he's a chain or not chain. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, chain or not chain. Yeah, you, you mean one of both. fast food? It can be, but it can be if you got a chain and a non-chain, then yeah, it can be one of each. Well, the reason I asked that, fast food, man. I'm, I'm skeptical to Doesn't say matter. the name of it because I'm skeptical to say the name of it because I don't want to like dox myself because it's pretty easy to find where this is, but like. Let me think about it, cause I I might just describe it and not say Bro, the actual I've, name. I've, I've drove two hours to go get food before, cause it's so good. <laughs> yeah, I uh, oh, um we haven't done that, but like my family will, um because we have a lot of we go down to um Chicago because my uncle lives down there and my ne- and my cousins, and um sometimes we'll go down there and you, if you ever heard of this place, um I th- it's not Shakespeare's it's what's it called Hold on, let me look it up. You guys keep talking. I don't, I don't think I have one. Like, I, there's a lot of places I like. There's a lot of places I like, but like nothing I like go to consistently. I guess. I don't know. Okay, what's your, maybe, what's your, maybe what's your favorite chain? Like... What's your favorite chain restaurant? So like McDonald's, KFC, Burger King, something like that. Yo Sushi, fuck it. Like something very widely internationally known. If that makes sense. 
Oh, I just found the name of it. If you, um, I can say real quick, it's called Giordan yeah, Giordano's. Um, I personally n not that big, not that big of a fan of it because like, what do you, do you guys like a lot of sauce on your pizza? Do you like a lot of cheese on your pizza? Both. I, I prefer my cheese. I don't like a lot of sauce, but I don't they, like a little sauce either. I like it in a pot in my sauce. Really? What they? I've never heard Oh yeah, uh, the, I've never tried that, but that actually sounds like a smart idea. But what they do pretty much is take like two things of tomato sauce and just pour that bitch on there and just oh, not that's even spur like that just seems too much. It, it's, yeah, that's it's way too much. Fucking it, it, you could like it. You can't taste cheese. You can't taste bread. It's just tomato sauce. And my dad, Bro, I hate that it. Sounds like a way for me to turn into crew real quick. Little yes. Caesars. <laughs> little Caesars. I've my never had soul. Little Caesars. I think I, I, I think I had Heaven. Little Caesars one time. Or was at like a birthday party? That was it. I, Wait, little really? Caesars, my yeah, I've Heaven, never. Bro. Bro, that's where you go for a pizza. Like that, that that's just like the choice. Like, cause like five bucks, easy. I'm yeah, not gonna fun, drop twenty dollars on a goddamn pizza. No, I'm just yeah, gonna exactly. go to Little Caesars. This man understands. This my, man understands how a pizza works. My pizza place of choice is Pizza Hut. Domino's. Dom pizza Hut. Really? Okay, okay. Oh, no, no. Okay, this is actually another question. Side question. Pizza Hut or Domino's go to non stuff crust and stuff crust? Which one? So well, if you go stuff crust, it doesn't matter because Domino's doesn't have stuff crust. I've never Wait, had stuff crust. Domino's doesn't Domino's have stuff crust here. No. Yo, what? Yeah, at least in like my hometown one. I don't Mine know does. if they do here. Mine Bro, does. I feel so sorry for you. Oh, that's why I got Little Caesar. Little Caesar stuff crust. Plus, they got the Does pepperoni you... stuff crust now. I don't want to try that so bad. That sounds dank. Yeah. Does your um, Pizza Hut do cheese bites as the crust? Oh, yeah. We have some you of that. Can. Bro, they're so good. Little Caesars yeah. does that, too. Yeah, Little Caesars does that. Bro, Little Caesars is just so a good. plate, bro. Little cheese Cheap, bites. amazing. Just... Hot and ready. Caesars is the place to go. Oh, like, okay. It okay. Right don't make, don't make fun. video. Like, just go in, get a movie, get a pizza, and you're you're set for the night. Lay's jerking off the ceiling, fan. <laughs> don't make fun, but I've been eating uh, dairyless pizza because my girlfriend she can't have she can't have any dairy, right? Oh, what, like, she's lactose intolerant. Yeah. No, 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 oh. she's allergic. Oh, she's Damn. allergic. Yeah, she's Damn. allergic. I've never heard of that. I it's, didn't know it's you. different. It's, it's like actually serious. <laughs> she doesn't spend a week on a toilet. Um, <laughs> so I've been eating cheeseless pizza and honestly the the thought of it was really disgusting to me and i was like i don't know if i could do that but one time she got it and i i had one of hers and i was like dang this isn't this isn't bad at all it, it definitely tastes different i don't know if it's any better but i was so shocked bro like the pizza without cheese is not as bad as i thought it would be if it you were pretty good if you were on a diet or something like that or you couldn't have cheese for a few months would you eat it like oh yeah 100 i think yeah. i would eat it i think i would order that if i'm eating pizza with her i would just get one large of that yeah and i'd be okay with it yeah yeah um have you ever had um a burger but it's like lettuce wrap never once my, in my just life. Sound, that just sounds like a fat that person so trying to be we know my my parents <laughs> so and a lot bad. of people my parents and a lot of people um do keto and yeah. in like yeah. what ke if you don't know what keto is um i'm not talking to you guys or if you do know what keto is to you guys i'm gonna tell them keto is basically where you can't have bread and you're basically overfueling your body on protein it's just, it's just my, my grandparents do that yeah it's it, you lose a, a ton of weight you can lose a lot no of weight if you, if you do it right i'm not saying go out there personally i don't i wouldn't do it when you're young i would get older um, I don't do it, but I've heard a lot of people of doing it, and I don't recommend it because it, you could fuck up your shit, to say the least. So I'm not promoting it or anything like that. Keto coma. In food groups. Yeah, yeah. Keto coma. yeah. That, and it's basically yeah. st it's starving yourself of that food group to where you lose weight, but you're still overloading yourself on protein. Kind of case yeah. it's fly. So you, 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 change, you change basically fat for muscle yeah that's what you're doing yeah but muscle's heavier but you, anyway. so you could still you could still get muscle like if i did it and went to the gym yeah. i would still be it's able to get just muscle. For losing weight yeah it's not just yeah, for losing weight also for bulking. yeah it's for also bulking it's all it's it, yeah. yeah it's the same thing with a, the, those guy. um i don't know exactly what keto is but i'm pretty sure you can't eat eggs either i can look up a list right now if i really wanted to but i'm not going to but um what they do is they basically take everything um, so what they do, I think Gabe, even if you guys know this comedian, Gabriel Iglesias did it. We, basically what he did is he'd go to like okay. In-N-Out and he would either get a burger, but take off and he would get like a double double, but he wouldn't get, he wouldn't eat the bread. He would eat, he would eat the lettuce, the tomato, the onions, the, and the cheese and the, um, the, uh, burger 
Or what you could do is if you really want to be like healthy, healthy, but also do keto, you could take, you pretty much take everything except the buns, put it in like a big head of lettuce, pretty much open the big head of lettuce and just form it around it. And I've never eaten it personally, but I've seen people eating it. And I just was like, that's not the same. That I'm, overly, I'm overly tempted to try that with like a takeaway burger just to see how that fucking tastes. I've asked my mom before and she's like, imagine a burger, but slimy. If you're like feeling it. Oh. I've had a lettuce oh. sandwich before. So <laughs> side note to when I was even more broke than I am like I am now. Like, I was dirt, dirt broke, and I looked in my fridge, I went, I got bread, I got butter, I got lettuce. Fuck it. <laughs> I was hungry. I put lettuce, butter, and bread. Yeah, for some reason, it tasted really nice. It sounds like American schools right now. They, they The American schools don't get, they don't, like, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm going back to school soon. They're not going to give us hot food. Like, 110% really? yeah. not. <laughs> no, they're not going to give us hot food. They're giving what? us fucking slop, pretty much. They're giving us, like, <laughs> corn that's cold or, like, bro, ham bro, bro. sandwiches back or some day, shit. Back in my we day, pots, we, used to have, we used to have this thing. Oh, my gosh. My first school I went to, or I guess second school I went to, they had these things. They were, like, pepperoni sticks. It was, like... It was like bread. The bread was really cheap. Like it was probably yeah. the worst part of it. Yeah. But then I had layered and cheese, and then had a layer. Oh, you're talking about panini, pepperoni, bro. And then a layer of cheese oh, on it, and then yeah. another piece of bread, and then they gave us like a dipping sauce. Oh my god, dude! Bro, I never used a dipping sauce. It's called a panini. Uh, whatever it's called. I don't give a shit what it's called. It was just delicious. It was so good. Oh, they yeah. had those, but then COVID hit. Uh, well, I shouldn't say that. I might have to censor that. Fuck. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know what to say after that. I'm fucked now. I'm like, I'm thinking, oh, that's gonna be a lot more work for me. Um, anyways, uh, I'm gonna, but like, they they had those, but then COVID hit, and they were like, no more hot food, only cold food, pretty much. I don't understand that. What was what's wrong with hot? Food? I don't know, dude. Like, it it's not like it spreads from like the kitchen. I don't know what it is, like, but like they my, were just like no more hot my, food. My school removed like metal cutlery. I can understand that because there was too many stabbings. But like hot food, <laughs> what is hot food? Do? Oh, the Do steam! The steam is everywhere. <laughs> Fucking Wait, stupid. To... Well, like we, we like it wasn't even. Plastic. We weren't even allowed to like get our food. Like you know how they have. Uh, it's like a yeah, salad you have bar. Tray and you go yeah. And take, they yeah. they don't have that anymore. They just have these styrofoam lunch things and it's just got like shit on it pretty much that's the only way i can describe it's it it's just matters, shit bro. yeah i see it <laughs> if it goes dead it goes dead can we switch it now go ahead yeah, yeah uh, if, so you, if you if you want to wait go wait supposed... yeah it's not a big deal not a big deal um but yeah it's like it's basically hot shit pretty much like no cold shit i should say because it's not hot and it's awful wait, you you had you got you could take your own food, bro. We got served it. They, no, no, we like, can't take our own food. We're not allowed what? to take no, our I own mean, food. You used to be able to. Oh yeah. You can't take your own food. No, they won't yeah, let us yeah, since COVID. Because of COVID. Yeah, we, even before Fuck, COVID. God we damn it! I need to censor that. Fuck. Oh my god. Just put co. And then yeah, I know co. Um, co video. So, Just so even that. even even before all that shit happened, like when I was in school, yeah, we didn't take our own food. They served it to us. Three meals then. Yeah, no, our mo our our meals are free now because fries. yeah, our meals are free ever since um ever since they s stopped serving hot lunches, but that was it. Like you can't take your own food now. Like they won't even let you um like I wasn't like last year I wasn't eating any of the food, like nothing, nothing at all. And I and it was yeah, awful. No, we were like yeah, we all 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 paid. We, I'm gonna we give had a thumbprint. Thing. Yeah, yeah, and we just had we. Had we, a, yeah, we yeah. We put money into like a machine, put our thumb on it, it registers our thumbprint, and it says your name, how much you've got, and that then you'd go amazing. up, you'd go up, pick what food you want, they'd put it on the tray for you, slide it round to the dinner lady, the other dinner lady. Yeah. She'd go, okay, you've got this, that, and the other. You put your thumb down, pay for it, take your food, and then fuck off. Yeah. You um, had everything right. from sandwiches, drinks, hot food, cold food, pasta pots, paninis, fucking it, there was pizzas. Yeah. They took those away because well, Jamie Oliver. Fuck you, Jamie Oliver. You ruined school meals. Sorry. Um. Well, like the thing is, is that subtitles. Yeah, I, I was, I was gonna say, can, can you do that with everything? I, uh, say me less work. <laughs> can you say, can you subtitle everything? I was gonna say, I'm not I, subtitling I'm this business. podcast, but I'll take it. 
um but yeah they uh i'll give my school credit like they did their best but like i still don't under like it wasn't just my school it was like a lot of other schools who were like no you can't have fucking um you can't have hot lunches so moving on because we've been yeah, talking about this in the last like back to previous note um chain chain restaurants and non-chain restaurants oh that yeah um i'll describe mine and it's it's a um it's bar food pretty much and like it's not a bar necessarily like i could go in there like they obviously they serve drinks because a lot of a lot of stuff um a lot especially in america they serve a lot of drinks in normal restaurants like i'm not talking about mcdonald's but like a mom and pop restaurant like yeah a mom and pop restaurant like i'm talking about yeah i'm not saying the name okay you know what i'll i'll give you a hint i'll give you a hint it was my favorite it was my favorite nba player it was it was the name of my favorite nba player kobe Fuck! <laughs> you got it right. Yeah, it's Kobe's. It's it, its name is Kobe's. I'm not gonna tell you how it's spelled. You have to guess. Um, but yeah, it was it, it's really good bar A-O-B-Y. food because it's a it's a steak it's a steak sandwich on grilled just bread. It's not like a bun. It's just like normal bread. But they put pepper jack cheese on it and steak and oh, it's pepper jack. dude. Fuck it. It dude. It this sandwich is um. I love this fuck it. Like I'll take that over that anything. Like sex on bread. I know. Bro, my 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 one. Obviously, none of you are gonna know it. But there's there's two. So when I'm when I'm in Lincolnshire with um, Lucy for university, there's a place called High and Pizza. Bro, they they sell the best pizza. And the funny thing is, it tastes better the next day cold. It makes no sense. But oh. it's the kind of pizza you can leave, and it tastes better the next day as well. Like it just gets better the longer you leave it. Burger King's nuggets only taste good the day after if you warm it up. Oh, really? Yes. Not I hate right. Burger King. Burger King's so I bad. I don't know how they're still even open. Burger King has they have a, more? Uh, if, so they, have like, they have like 60 cents, like 10 nuggets. Uh, if anybody watching is trying to lose weight, I know a trick. Um, if you go up don't to eat a Burger King, yeah, don't eat a Burger King in the first place. It's fucking awful. It's awful. But if you, but if you're like for some reason in love, if you're in love with Burger King foot lettuce and still want to be healthy, you go up to the window and there's um, you could say a burger. I forget which burger it is. It's it's like the American Royale or something like that. I forget what exactly what it's called. But you could say um, give me it the keto way or something like that, and they will take off everything for you and they will put like a fork and stuff in there. If you ever need to, I don't know why you're trying to lose weight at Burger King. Like the most I can recommend you to a lose salad. weight, the most, yeah, not even a salad. Yeah. Just get like a McDonald's fucking for you, get man. a Coke Zero and go to McDonald's and get like a salad with strawberries in it or something, or Wait, go to McDonald's Wendy's. McDonald's doesn't sell salads anymore. No, they don't. Yeah, they fucking do. <laughs> yeah, they do. They don't. Do. Hey, did yeah, you guys ever watch do. that Super Size Me documentary about yeah, McDonald's? We yeah. School. yeah, yeah. Years ago, bro. Oh yeah, years, years ago. ago. Years ago. I think it was he the never, same he age. He never, never like, finished it. He like threw up and like. Uh, like no, he finished it, but like after that, he was like, "I'm fucked." This documentary just put it out there, pretty much. And I feel bad. I, I forget that guy's name, but like that guy, that guy just did it for the content. He was like yeah. one of the first. What's the, uh, the other one uh, that's near here? Is called a uh, Grill House. Mm-hmm. That's another fucking place. That's dank. They do amazing butterfly chicken. Really? Yeah. And their chips taste so good. They're peri- Turkish people just make really fucking good peri peri chips and fucking chicken, bro. It hits different. That and kebabs, they, uh, they hit different. Okay. Let's get a- ramen, like legit ramen. We have oh, a ramen yeah. place by my house. It's all right. I don't want to try that. It's it get you oh, get the, to- get something spicy because without the spiciness, it kind of like tastes bland, kind of. So yeah. Um, let's move on from food before Cruz starts eating his keyboard or something like that. Um. But, um, here, <laughs> bless you. You sound like Michael Jackson there. What the fuck? Yeah, <laughs> um, but me, um, I know Miku and Watch. Miku and Blade were talking about this the other night. But, um, do you think COD will ever recover from how bad it is right now? From like with Warzone yeah, and the hackers and just, and like just the fact that like everybody's like fuck COD, especially with like everything that's been said about the office, about them drinking and like playing during out during work hours and stuff like that. Do you think it, it'll ever recover like it was in like Black Ops Two? I would play. It takes one game. Yeah, one game it takes one game. I think it'll take one it, game. That's but what in... MW Two was and Black Ops Two was. Yeah, it took one game and it blew the fuck up. And they're still world renowned now. Oh yeah, like people still play them. Oh yeah, it's yeah. not like it, it, the COD franchise will never die off. It, it'll either have to be like ended because the company like goes dead after like a hundred plus years of making games, or. What's gonna more than likely happen is is that they're gonna make one game. They're gonna make re- one really really good game, 
like it may even be like a remastered version of like Black Ops Three. Like that could even happen. They're, bro, they're probably Zombies was the, my favorite, bro. Black Ops Three. They're probably gonna remaster Black Ops Three. Guarantee it. They've yeah. done all the maps into oh, the yeah. new Cold War. Oh yeah. There's no way they they're don't. They're probably gonna do it. If if they don't, but, um, if they don't, like people will be like upset in the next like five oh, five yeah. years. But um, but yeah, people are upset now. Oh yeah. Are you guys looking into the next one, the new one coming? Yeah, out Yeah, Vanguard. It's uh, the oh, yeah, the uh, yeah. as of recording this, it um then it's tomorrow that they reveal it. Oh yeah, it's yeah. It's today Warzone, right? Uh yeah, Warzone. No, uh, yeah. do they? I think they're revealing it. I think it's a uh, another event. Well, I know they did like the mm -hmm. a custom like in screen with like some really really like old sniper lady shooting one guy out of the helicopter like thing or whatever. Yeah, I know it's that, that today. It? Yeah, I don't. That, uh, was, that, was, that, that was a few days ago. That was a few days ago. Yeah. I saw that a few days ago on like TikTok. Obviously, I don't play Warzone because my PC's a piece of shit. With but anybody watching, if they want to see more like Warzone stuff or Call of Duty stuff, I'm working on it. Just give me, yeah. give me a, give me a few months. All right, I'm working on it. All right, I'm in the corner. I will donate enough sperm. I will donate enough sperm. I, I will donate enough sperm. Dude, it, dude, oh, yeah, I guess, I guess 90, we should 90, probably 90, talk about like, what we're doing right now. What do you like, mean? None of us are like. I guess you're kind of posting. Blade, I see yeah. a video just came up, but we're all kind of scattered okay. right now. Yeah, I'm, well, I've started posting we all know where crew is. Again. We all know how crew's doing well, over there. Just like in a dairy oh, queen. That. Explain like what's oh. going on right now, Blade. Uh, so, so for me, uh, for people who don't know, uh, I'm a full time editor um, for other people. So you could say his name, and I'm hopefully getting more. Uh, so I got Logan. I got Logan Echo is the main one that I uh, edit for, and I've started editing for a guy named Danny and Ali. Um, that's another guy I've started diagonally. <laughs> diagonally, um, <laughs> but uh, that's a Harry Potter reference. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I've started editing for them, and I've just basically figured out a schedule that doesn't make me want to kill myself, where I can start editing my footage and get rid of a terabyte and a half of fucking recording because it's killing was, my PC. I was gonna say, um, I remember, um. Me and crew were watching uh, an R6 video he just posted a few days ago. Oh, it's like two months old, bro. Yeah, and me yeah, and crew, yeah, me yeah. And, like he, Blade had showed us that like two from like two months ago, and we were like, "Did he already oh. post this? Was it he? Did he repost this?" I'm like, "There's no way." I'm like, "He already showed us this in Discord, but just never uploaded it. It's just yeah. been in the backlog." It's because, it's because I was trying to sort out my schedule. Yeah. Not only that. Yeah. You know the prop hunt videos. Uh, I think. I think I uploaded prop hunt today. today. Yeah, today. Um, yeah. yeah, the prop hunt video I uploaded today is like four or five months old. Like, on a reel. I didn't even know I had it. Me and Vic were just in a chat, and I started deleting Gmod stuff that I've already edited, got rid of, uploaded, that sort of kind of thing. Like, you know when you do a fresh clean? Yeah. I clicked on a project, and I had two videos just chilling there, and I never uploaded I was like, oh, shit, sweet. Yeah. I'm going to upload those. Those were the session, you know, when it was Mac. Mm -hmm. Mac, you, crew, Vic. Yeah, and we had... And um, that was the pizza. Yeah, that was ages ago. Yeah, we... Like, uh, that was so long ago. Yeah, there were some problems after that recording session. I'm not going to th throw out names, but um, there were some problems. My mother just... You, but yeah, that so. was that was so long ago, bro. But I've started uploading now, and I've yeah. started editing Minecraft because of the new series. Yeah. Thank God I've been on that. Um... I don't want to jump ahead, but I, um, the re the thing that's going on with me is is that I'm basically trying to post once a week. I know people are like, "Oh, we want to see more videos more often." Um, I don't have any editors. If anybody couldn't tell, um, I'm 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 not gonna say, "Oh, I'm the best editor," but I'm the best editor I could get, which is just me. I'm not. I don't have the money to pay for an editor right now. And if I would, I don't think I don't feel like I should, because um, I need to. I feel like I need to experience the grit and grind of editing a lot especially when school starts up which is here in a few days i want to i want to experience the grit and grind of trying to edit like that so i can improve more because um i think i i take yeah i take a lot of um i take a lot of what i learned in basketball and sports and stuff like that and bring it over towards youtube which is like trying to get into the grit and grind of everything and stuff like that and trying to learn how to um better myself through bullshit that happens whether it be recording sessions that's fucked up or something like that for example a few weeks a few weeks ago i had record we were recording gta 5 and um i recorded the wrong screen and i was i ended up recording discord the whole time well oh, i yeah it, 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 su it sucks it sucks it fucking sucks. Su it fucking sucks but 
now I'm working <laughs> a, I'm working on a Discord funny moments so I can turn that into a Discord funny moments. Like that's what yeah. and I feel like yeah. I feel like um turning that into something I feel like turning bullshit that is bad and turning it into something that is actually good for me is something that I need to work on cuz what I would used to do is if something fucked up I'd be like fuck this I'm done for the oh, day. Oh yeah yeah. I feel or, right. I'm not I'm not I'm not posting this. Well, not well me now is like I need to work on this and stuff like that. But um yeah. Yeah, like I said, I'm um I'm posting once a week. I don't, I'm not. I honestly, I'll be honest. I don't have a job right now. I'm work. I'm working on it. Um, I'm. The problem is, is that uh, there's certain things that come up, whether it be family vacations, stuff like that, or emergency trips, even that we have planned. Um, I won't say why. Um, stuff like that, and um, it's hard to it's hard to get like especially like a Walmart manager to be like, hey, so I'm gonna be out of the country. I'm gonna be out of the state for like two weeks at a time. You just take me off the shifts all at that time, but whatever you call it, and it's hard to convince what you something have to like do that. Is get um, a zero hour contract. That yeah. way, you can't. You can basically say to him, "No, I'm not working any hours this week," or you can accept the hours that week. That's what zero hour contracts are. Yeah, they give you hours you can decline or accept them. Yeah, that's and the kind of that's the kind of contract that. you'd need. Yeah, I never heard of that either. Um, but and I also don't want to be that asshole who's like, "Well, I'm just waiting to find the perfect job that's right for me." I, I just don't want to be that Editing. asshole. Yeah. Well, like, I've I've applied, and I even, like, the oh, other it night... sucks for applying. Yeah, it the other night, sucks. like, I'm not gonna lie, and Blades told me this himself, he got really lucky finding Logan. He just found him at the right time. Well, L- Logan is a saint, and he doesn't even realize... Logan knows he's a saint. I love the man to bits, and if you're somehow watching this, thank you for employing me and giving me a life. Oh, trust um, me. Oh, trust me. We're gonna make but, highlights of this and post them on TikTok. Bro, on a, on a real... Logan is the luckiest find ever. You're when you start editing for people that don't know, you literally will spend probably about a year, six months to a year searching for a job before you even get a lick of it. I searched for a month and found one. I am way above average on finding jobs. It's unbelievable. I've had two within the space of since February, and that's unheard of for yeah. editors and c- cust- uh, for uh, creative people. I got so lucky. All I did, I, I was scrolling through TikTok and Logan just popped up in my feed. I fucking hit him up. was like, bro, I'm looking for editing jobs. You want an editor? He was like, fuck yeah. Got on a Discord call. Five minutes later, I got a job. I'm like, sweet. Yeah. Um, a quick tip to, for anybody who's wanting to get into editing for people. Apply to multiple people. Don't apply to one big creator. Because I applied to this dude who had, I think, like... 60k at the time and um me in my mind i was like oh yeah well i can see if he actually accepts it or not well then i realized i stopped looking for that night and there must have been like multiple creators that were smaller but were able to pay and paying's a pay don't don't edit for people who are and you're like oh well, i'm gonna get subscribers off of this like get a job to get a job to get make money like eventually if they get big you'll get big with them if not you get yeah. money either way. Don't apply to be no, an editor. Just just but you got to remember, your t- your time is worth something. Oh, like, yeah. You're not oh, worth yeah. below minimum wage. Like, oh, if yeah. If you work for less than minimum wage, you ain't doing something right. Don't work for free. Oh, yeah. Because then you're ruining the creative industry. Oh, yeah. And, and don't work for lower than minimum wage. Yeah, I don't mean to cut you off, but um, anybody who's on, like, Twitter or Instagram or TikTok, whatever the fuck, please stop trying to get free Fortnite and Roblox editors. Kiss my ass. <laughs> Motherfuckers are just everywhere. <laughs> just me and fucking me and, everywhere. Me and Tom the other night, yeah, Vic. We were scrolling for a job listing because I was looking for more jobs and I was applying to extra people. The amount of people that are going, free editor, free editor, free editor. I'm like, fuck no, fuck no, fuck no. Internship, no. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like, like, and they're, and like, none of them are like funny moment editors. They're like montage editors. Like, I want a Fortnite Pro mixtape. And I'm like, first of all, it's not a mixtape. It's not a fucking like and one back in like 2001, the professor thing. It was logic. It's a, yeah, yeah. It like, yeah, I'm going to put some EDM music over there and edit like sound effects into you killing people. Like, that's the most I can do when it comes to montage editing. I've tried before, never worked out. I immediately, but I immediately got good at um, funny moment editing. So that's my taste. I don't, I, and I'm not like being like, oh, if you play Fortnite, you're a faggot, because Quisca still plays Fortnite a little bit. What I am saying is. I've played Fortnite in like four months, bro. Well, I just, I just didn't want to offend you. Dude. I, yeah. <laughs> Um, I just, I like, I'm just, is that like everybody's so much better than me now? Cause like I stopped playing for like two months and then 
I fell off, obviously. Oh, yeah. Well, like, you weren't as bad as me. I tried to go pro on Fortnite, and we all know how... We can all see how that went. I'm doing a podcast yeah, with three other go pro, pro, you go funny yes, moments. No. That's what most people do, to be honest with you. If they try to go pro <laughs> and end up failing, they'll just end up being Legion. a content creator in, in some way or another. They'll either, like, get pissed and be like, fuck, fuck all the orgs who didn't want to sign me or whatever, and just be, like, an offen uh, offensive creator when they're just making dark jokes. Or they'll just... Yeah, cool, be cool. a content creator that also is a uh, semi-pro, if that makes sense. So they'll do scrim skirmishes and stuff like skirmishes. The fuck did I just say? <laughs> Scrim <laughs> scrimmages. Scrimmages. Your retainer back in. I am I'm <laughs> next. If hey, if whoa, we get whoa, if we get like a hundred likes on this, I'll put it in for the whole podcast next episode. On God. A hundred likes. I yo, bro. Oh God, if we get a hundred likes, I think I'll shit myself. Oh, me too, bro. I go crazy. I'll, I'll, I'll take a laxative, bro, and try and sit in a podcast, bro. <laughs> but yeah, like, all these, like, people who are like, oh, yeah, uh, I'm a, like, especially, like, people who are signed, if you guys know this org, it's called Luminosity. Like, Luminosity say they're, like, a pro org, when in reality, most of them yeah, are content creators. Yo, yeah, oh, you bitch. But uh, yeah, <laughs> hold on. I got I got another question I wanted to ask you. That uh, where's my notes at? Um. Oh wait. <laughs> okay. Okay. Here's one. What do you think of TikTok creators that have no talent? So what I'm saying, when no talent, I mean like dancing videos and stuff like that. And uh, do they deserve their fame? So for example, does Charlie D'Amelio deserve the fame she gets? Or the guys who are making podcasts and ed editing 15 hours a day uh, deserve fame. I think Depend both to each their own. Yeah, yeah, people get big for a reason. There's a reason. Yeah. She's at where she's at. Well, that's so it's like, um, like throw, throw egg socks out there, for example, like good, fr good friend that I know. I have no. He, he grew big because he knew he was smart. Like these people, yeah, some of them are thick as shit and no, they do not deserve yes. what the fuck they have. Yes. And then some of them are fucking geniuses. They're yeah, algorithmic I geniuses. I was going to say. Because Exoc has 200, 200k subs because he's a fucking genius. And he hit a market on the fucking dot as he did it. Like, I mean on the dot. Because that boy brought out, like, the dr he brought out all the dream stuff that he does. Like, how dream does this, how dream does that. They yeah. hit my hump. Hunting Hitman shit that he yeah, did, yeah. all the parkour shit he did, because there was a market for it at that exact moment. The boy blew up immediately. Within two months, he had 100k. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, it's just how it is. It's right? just it's just a lot of it's work, though. Like, yeah, understanding yeah. work, doing your research. Yeah, I, a Being lot a of it, like 90% of the time, it's because they did it right. Mm -hmm. They did it in the right time. They, yeah. they did it. Yeah, like you can't knock just a certain group of people. Like you can't say all dancers don't deserve. Yeah, like maybe there's one that like. I, I'm and, I, and I'm not saying lucky. I'm I'm not saying fuck every person who dances on TikTok. I'm just saying, what's your guys' opinion Man, on it? I'm a professional dancer on TikTok. My what opinion, my opinion on it is that Bitch, do I've it. Got qualification in dancing. Fuck you. <laughs> my opinion on it is that you could do whatever you want, and um, dancing. if you end up like getting famous, that's fine with me. But if you try to act like this big giant celebrity, the only people that I like think are celebrities. Or like Charlie D'Amelio and Addison Rae, and the only reason they're famous right now is because yeah, they're hot. All right, <laughs> one, <laughs> one, one of them's underage, but you know that's fine. So am I, so it doesn't matter. Oh, for fuck's sake! Just, he's older than me, though, so it doesn't matter. Okay, whatever. Moving on. Um, they were like the first to do the dancing stuff. Not the first, but like people that got really big because they were like they the first. They got on it quick. They, yeah, they, they yeah. Jumped on it. Which they did it? They're famous because they went on the fucking like. So all these celebrity shows, but like the people who are like who have like a million followers, just bridging the gap and average like three thousand views, and try to think they're like yeah. they're like multi-platform basis. And like, I've seen this one girl. I'm not gonna say her name, but her name is Sophia Spam. Sometimes, um, what she what she does what she does is yo yo sorry can i interrupt you quickly hold the <laughs> thought and remember it yeah bro my man literally just went i'm not gonna mention her name it's like like some rapist that like fucked you up a couple years ago but you love him still it's like i'm not oh. gonna mention mark frankenstein's name yeah. but you know yeah. he's that's really exactly nice. what i did that's exactly <laughs> what i did just i'm not gonna oh, talk no. about Voldemort, but <laughs> 
Oh my God. What the fuck? <laughs> I didn't hear a word Jesus you said. Christ. <laughs> but yeah, you were saying about a girl that you didn't mean to mention, but yeah, mentioned because you're a weirdo. I what she to... has huh? is she's basically showing her ass every video because she's hot. I'll admit. That's what I should do. <laughs> Honestly, if people got an ass that can sure make money, it. why not show it? That's how I feel about it. <laughs> oh no. Oh god, yes. Uh, can we blur out the balls? Can, can, can we blur out the balls? Can we blur out the balls? We need to blur out the balls. Your balls are on show, bro. <laughs> yeah, we need to blur that out. That needs to be blurred. You can see <laughs> Um. Anyways, sorry, I was texting somebody. Oh, fuck me, dude. That is awful. Um. Anyways, anyways, what, what oh, I, shit. what I, um, what she does is she basically shows her ass, and she is streaming on Twitch now. Not sh well, she didn't switch platforms. She does both at the same time. My honest to God problem with it is just the fact that, like, she does with Am what Amaranth's doing pretty much, which is just going on just chatting and just sitting there talking. Like, Twitch was made to be gaming content. And basically, and, and, uh, and sometimes I have this urge to just say this sometimes, but whenever I see people do that, they, I feel like they just do it so they can get donations because TikTok doesn't pay a lot. And especially with her content being the way it is, she doesn't make a lot of money from pay. TikTok alone. It so, pays per thousand views, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I did not know that. Yeah, and um, yeah. so if somebody got like 47,000 views, they're going to get $47. So, so long something like, oh, like that. a thousand views per like, dollar? That's actually, that's it's, not some, that it's like CPM, but it's like the same as CPM in YouTube. Well, anyway, she like it's called the Creator Fund, and a lot of people who um who post stuff like bikini stuff and stuff that's very very close to bridging the gap between sexual in a sexual manner. Um, it's called the Creator Fund, and like a lot of people will go get get downgraded on the Creator Fund, or even get the Creator Fund taken away, so then they're making less money or no money. Um, but what I feel like people do is they, um, they'll go on just ch on Twitch and just do just chatting thinking, oh, it's the same as TikTok. When in reality, they're not going to pull the same amount of viewers or anything like that. Cause people are only there well, to watch gaming stuff. That's the thing is there was a debate recently, which was, is 40 million TikTok followers the same as having like, ten, uh, for, like 10 million subscribers because you know what I think with yeah with with subscribers you're watching like say for I watch the Sidemen with Lucy for example um and we watch those videos for like an hour and a half they're like almost full length films for yeah, fuck's yeah. sake like and they've got 10 million subs they're that's 15 million people 7 million people sometimes their their views on some of their videos you but like when you subscribe to someone you're choosing to get their content, which is like 10 minutes long, hour long, half an hour. Yeah. Because like, cause that's how much time and attention you want to give that person. You like that person. I feel like with TikTok, it's more of, yeah, you may like the personality of the person, but that's only 10% of your audience yeah. is going to like your personality and actually be fans. Whereas <clears throat> the other 90% or 99% of, there's no fucking number for it. I'm just making up a figure. It's, you know, well, it's do. also like it's, it's just Go gonna ahead. be people that liked a video and thought, "Fuck it, I'll follow you." You make a few funny yeah, that's jokes. What I was yeah, that's that for sure. Yeah. What I was that is that's exactly yeah. what I think as well. Um, I feel like, I oh, fuck, I forgot what I was just say. Um, shit. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's all. It's way easier to grow on TikTok than it is on YouTube as well, because TikTok oh, yeah. is pushing the fuck out of like all your all of the yeah. into into different people's like, for example, for you pages. And um, so, for example, I could no, upload, I could no. upload the same exact clip onto TikTok and upload it onto YouTube, and ten out of ten, nine out of ten times, the TikTok will get more views, but it won't get as many followers. I don't think. Or, well, also TikTok's algorithm. Uh, fucking shout out to TikTok. They have the best algorithm in the fucking world. I think they they're for, like, geniuses. Content. They are fucking pioneers of algorithms and like more platforms need to do what they do twitch is starting to follow with it like they do the recommended for you and it's actually really good because it pushes small creators yeah because yeah. i watch because i um, subscribe to logan on thing i get a lot of small creators like if you follow one small creator they keep pushing you small yes, creators. Yeah, i have really noticed cool. that i have noticed that a lot. i've actually i actually really like it 
But like TikTok's algorithm is fucking insane. So the way it works is what they'll do is they'll push it out to a hundred people. As soon as you upload a video, they push it out to a hundred people. They say it works. And then if for every person you get, they push it out to double that number. So if you get 30 people watch it, they'll push it out to 60. 60 people watch it they'll push you out to 120 and they keep doubling and doubling and doubling and that's how when you get a million views you can get to 2 million really quick, yeah, real quick. and then 4 million and then 8 million and it just goes up and up and that's how t- TikTok algorithm works for every view you get they push you out to double the people and it just keeps going and going you, and you going and if, going you wonder if YouTube's the same but like you gotta think you, YouTube could have the exact same algorithm but the way you look at TikTok, TikToks, is you scroll, there's a you video, scroll. you give yeah. it like two seconds, and if you don't, you don't have any interest, you scroll right away. YouTube's yeah. different. It is based on that thumbnail. So you could have someone who just literally slides up their page and pass your video. And they could never even well see the video. They could never yeah. even see the video. But that counts as still a view that didn't count for you. So think about it. YouTube's bigger. Like I don't know if you. I I it's don't think you can five hundred minutes. Five hundred minutes of footage uploaded every minute. That's on what I'm average. saying. YouTube YouTube is bigger right now. Oh, I, yeah. I TikTok might take over eventually. But YouTube is bigger right now. Yeah, that's it's when so and, that, and that's when the Earth the turns into there's more zombie people, apocalypse. There's more people. It's harder to see the videos. It's probably harder to push the videos because oh, there yeah. is more people. Oh yeah. You got to think they could have the exact same algorithm, but since TikTok's smaller and shorter it might be harder to push that content. Well, especially with oh, yeah. people's attention spans nowadays. I'll, re- I'll look, I'll, I'll, fucking dog shit. I'll catch oh, myself yeah, doing yeah. it all the I time. I'll, 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 I'll try to watch like a 10 minute YouTube video. Well, I could watch 10, one minute TikToks. I uh, no, the thing yeah. is, dude, Simon are like the only people who can keep my attention lately. I'm not even joking. Uh, well, like, what, what, uh, yeah, Simon. I know exactly Bro, what you're talking about. They fucking broke the game when it comes Bro. when it comes to like footage. They are those busted. guys have pushed it to a new level. Those are like Dude, that's like British so jackass good. on YouTube. That's the crazy that's thing. Exactly is, what I found it is. them through Deji too. Kind of, kind, kind of. of, kind of. I don't want to say they're like they're, they're as like, bad. They're like a mi- this is this is how I could explain it to like an American. They're like a mix between they do dumb shit like Jackass, not nearly as fucking bad. Yeah, they do dumb shit and they're comedians whilst doing it. I think they're like dude perfect. They're, they're the per- they're the perfect mix between are, comedian they're, 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 and dumbass. Oh yeah, they go so well together. Oh, like, yeah. all of their personalities go so well Bro. together. So the guy Vicstar, one of the guys, does yeah. not belong there. If you look Dude, at him I I, from I, I a picture, agree. he does not belong there between all of them. Like, they all suit each other. Vic is, like, an outstander, but, yeah, he fits like a fucking glove. Yeah, yeah, yeah. personality-wise, like, they're, they're together. Yeah. What what Blay was saying about the Twitch thing, it, it's interesting to me because I even saw that because I watch a lot of um, Pezzy. If you guys Porn. don't know. Pe- Pezzy, goddammit. Porn. Pezzy. Porn. Um, but who Pezzy is, if you guys don't know, it's basically... Um, he plays with Grizzy. He lives with Grizzy, as actually. I should probably say that. But um, he has a friend group with all these guys on it. And I, I have, like... I know that bits are measured in the amount of... A lot of bits are measured in the amount of time. To put it in perspective, I have, like, 10K bits or something like that. Not a ton. Oh, well, you're talking about points. Yeah. Channel points. I'm sorry. Watching, channel points. Yeah, channel yeah watching points. points. Yeah, channel I have, like, 10K. So it's, like... I, I don't have the bits. most... Yeah, swing that my way. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't have like, the most, you but like, bit and I was like Bitcoin. I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, I, I hang them up on my wall. That, that's all you can do with Bitcoin nowadays. Um, but yeah, it's basically the fact that I have like 10k hours on Pezzy. Not 10k hours. Fuck. Um, anyways, I keep getting recommended his friend group as well. So I, I got recommended Tuxi first, but then I got recommended um, uh, what's that, that's, yeah. That's what's so good about working together with people oh yeah and like oh once yeah you start, once they start putting you in their in their links yeah then then youtube's like oh they're together so it's like yeah well, you watch this it's video like, um, you like tag. it you're gonna put him with him yeah the you're second put him with the other person video. yeah the second i got i got put in blades descriptions and stuff i immediately went up like I don't want to say 100 subs because that that's not realistic, but like 20 to 30. No, I think you I think you went up from like 100 to about 149 yeah. in a couple of months or something yeah. like that. And there were some also people that gave me some subs, but we, I don't want to talk about them because, you know. Um, but it, it is insane. As soon as you put someone in like your tags and your description, yeah. you do see that your videos start getting recommended. And oh, if yeah. you look at your studio, you can see, oh, 
<laughs> That's where that person came from. Sweet. Yeah. yeah. Every time, every time I play with you or Kawiska, I'm always like Kawiska in the <laughs> tags. Blade Sync. I even put like hashtag Blade Sync in the um hashtag. Blackface. 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 Yeah, blackface. Yeah, blackface. It, there you go. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I ain't talking about Kawiska skin. I ain't talking um, about Aunt Jemima. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, we made it. We made it. What, well, uh, five minutes without a black joke? Yeah. The, no, I'm reco- I've been recording for 55. I've been recording for 55. Y'all want to keep going? Y'all want to end you, it? You, you still eating? You still eating there, crew? Yo, fine shit. I just started eating. <laughs> oh. um, well, let's keep it going. Let's, let's go for like another 30 minutes, I guess. Is everybody I down? Bell, y'all. Oh, you got the y'all. Oh, you got the shits. <laughs> You're no, gonna have the shits. Yo, you guys tried the, their quesadilla or quesadilla or what is it called? Quesadilla? <laughs> They have a special name for it, don't they? Yeah, it's like a case of... I don't know, man. I got a quesadilla right now, though. That's all I know, man. Uh, I'm going to take a laxative and know the difference. I don't know. I, I like them, but I have their, their quesadillas. Yeah, I had a steak one and a chicken one both times. Dude, whatever sauce they put in that thing, bro, I don't care what anybody says about Taco Bell, bro. It is busting. It you is mean so good. Cheese? Huh? That's what they put in it. It's queso cheese. Oh, well, whatever that is. <laughs> it's cheese with like. Wait, you're Mexican you know, but don't know what queso is? I don't know what queso is. Okay, I was just, I was just say, I was just say you cannot like not know. Um, okay, I guess that's uh, like uh, me being British and not knowing tea. Okay, I'll say the next question. Busting, what is, what is a game that you guys honestly thought that you would like, but immediately regretted playing, um, like immediately? Where yeah. Today. I freaking hate that game. Really? It's so bad. I'm so glad. My friend bought it for me because I told him I didn't want to play it. No, that was a lie because I knew I didn't want to play it. And then I hated it. That's a hard fucking fool, bro. Yo, that's actually hard. A game that Shit. I knew I would want to play. Yeah. Yeah. A game you thought you'd want to play. No, a game. Really it and it's yeah, a game you, you thought you would like, but then immediately regretted playing it like the All second. Guys. Whether, All guys. Whether it be like from popularity or from like people edging you on or even if edging you on. Um, or from people like, just don't use your eyebrows like that. Um, or people like um ruining it for you, for example, because the, my game someone ruined it for me, and I think all of you know what I'm about to say. Among but us, I, I yeah, so a- yeah. My my um, my game is just I Among Us. Answers. I fucking I hate Among answers. Us. I liked it like when I played it. I, as long as I had I a group like it, of like my yeah. actual friends. I like it, but not playing it in the normal way. I don't enjoy the normal way of playing Among Us anymore. I, did. I fucking I did enjoy the normal way, not anymore. At first, I was like, "Oh, this is a cool game," blah 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 blah. But like, as soon as like the a lot of YouTubers stopped playing it as much, so for example, like oh, Wildcat, for example, it got fucking competitive too, yeah, and it just too they shit stacked a bunch of these mods on there as well that like, drove me up the fucking wall wait, so wait. bad. Tell me this. Tell me this. Do you guys think games are better in their like pre stage where? Like say Fortnite when people didn't know how to build yet. Oh yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Ghost stages. Do you think like that's when the game's Some, better? It varies on the game. It varies on the game. Yeah. Fortnite for me was not that good. Like Fortnite for me was like, like season. I think it was like, what? When did they have? When did like the first sand the um palm trees come out? Or not the palm tree, oh, but the um like season three. Um yeah, season five or six. I think it was See, it's something like, try, like that. Try, try, so I, I yeah, don't even know what yeah. Was. Well, the only oh, reason wait. I the only reason I say that is because I, I was um I was still trying to go pro on Fortnite, and I remember having so much fun because I would I would like play pubs all day, but then I would um because, and I wouldn't get any wins by the I'm way. I would get every. No, you pubs. Pu- pu- would, pubs are public yeah, matches. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know that. That was, that was just your ADHD kick. Like, oh, it's gonna be so yeah. big. Yeah. I think I found out a game that I fucking bought and I never fucking played and enjoyed it. Pub fucking what? G. There you go. Oh, Thank you. Figured I out. I never bought it. I got it for free though. Well, the, yeah, who did you play? Did you play it by yourself, Blade, or did you like play it with other people? I played it with people and I played it by myself. Both times it sucked. I never just couldn't it. really couldn't get into it. Yeah. Um, I I feel like um yeah, but like I was saying, Among Us is like the most shit game to me, just because people like after people stopped um after people stopped like playing it on YouTube, um I feel like especially with the group, friend group we had, um it got extremely fucking competitive no matter what we did, whether it was 
playing at night late at night or playing super early in the morning everything was just kill 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 uh, but there was also some things that came up that also pissed me the fuck off to no extent for example um th other people being allowed to troll but i wasn't and nobody else was i should say or like uno uh, this is like uno it ruins friendships bro yeah i will say uno. i like uno Uno, I never. Amazing, Uno, I, I think the only reason I never, I'm never into Uno is just the fact that I'm an FPS you guy. Always lose. You always lose. Yeah, that too. I always no, get hit with it. Actually, that's what I was gonna say. Portal or Splitgate. Sorry. Uh, it's fun. I played it in like, the early I stages. I, I haven't played it now. Yes. I can't deny it. It is. It is fun. Splitgate is a top five game right now. It's going to get so annoying once the people start understanding how the portals work oh, once they fully start sweating on it, i'm talking like pop portal here pop portal here jump through snipe fall back through set another one snipe it again it's gonna once be all the war zone tryhards all over. over again yeah, yeah it's over like that that's gonna be streamed like even crazy. if it even wrong. if it's not it cheating even if it's not cheating People are still gonna try hard, so fucking hard, yeah, and and saying. it's gonna like, be it's gonna, gonna use the mechanics. Yeah, it's like, gonna be so just like cool. Fortnite. It's gonna be just like Fortnite, where it's just gonna tr everybody's gonna try to go pro. Everybody's gonna try to go pro in Portal. Like I literally saw a dude you know on TikTok today. Enjoying. What? I've stopped enjoying um, just games that start becoming hack heavy very quickly. Yeah, I I, I know you stop playing a lot of Warzone. Too there are way t yeah that is one of the reasons there are way too many people nowadays that because they're not good at games or because they struggle just, at games yeah, they're just hacking Wait, like mm -hmm. i can understand certain games i i have like ethics wise why they'll do it or something like that like morals wise yeah black like ops GTA, 2 for, for example yeah black ops 2 oh, black, as black well. ops 2 is dead black ops 2 is so old it makes sense it's, yeah it's such an old game yeah. i can understand hackers which, in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah they have no reason to, to ban people at that point yeah exactly. which by the way um if anybody does want to play black ops 2 i know a way uh go look up plutonium.com Go install Black Ops 2. It's completely safe, by yeah, the way. I've tried it. <laughs> yeah, I know. I No, I, we have a different sponsor, but I'll do that here in a little bit. But, um, like, for example, GTA, I can understand people hacking that. I really can. The game is way too grindy oh. online, and yeah. I can understand, because Rockstar basically made an online game want to be played single player. That's how bad that game has got. But something like Warzone, the fun of the game is is getting that win like you get Fuck. some people get especially myself an adrenaline rush yeah. winning a game because oh it requires gosh, I feel that. I feel that. process and skill it's why so many people have transferred from warzone to apex and are finding apex hard because apex requires even more skill Dude, apex got, is so fun it's got such a fucking high surface like level of skill it's like going from like i don't even know what it's like going from cod to rainbow six siege mm -hmm. it's like yep. completely different gameplay game mechanics but, like, similar all at the same time is yeah. weird. It's still Bro, an FPS. Like, yeah, yeah. It's still an FPS, but you have to think about everything in such a different way. Okay. Like, this, it's yeah. unbelievable. This is a good transition. What are your top five games right now? Like right no, I'm not talking about oh. this year. I'm not talking about last year. I'm talking about right now right as we now? speak. As we speak. Um, mine. Yeah, mine would probably be right now, to top of like wanting to play is like Minecraft. <laughs> Mm -hmm. CSGO and R6. Mm -hmm. They're like the top three I've been wanting to play, and I'm always down to play. Yep. And they're like top, top list for me. Like R6, I could play every fucking day right now. Yes. Not bad an eyelid, and I could masturbate whilst doing it left handed. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's he's done it before. I'm, kidding. I'm, kidding. I'm, ki I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Next is like Cold War. As much as it yeah. pisses me off, yeah. uh, I, I have. I enjoy playing Cold War, especially because I play Cold War with my other half, Lucy. I play it with her because that's the game we can play together and we can vibe over that game. Pisses the fuck off of me. I've smashed my desk more times than I count, and my wireless mouse has almost went wireless across the room. Um, so, yeah, when I play Cold War... I almost did that 5G. Play... <laughs> just yeah. like to check G502. <laughs> yeah, imagine imagine this little thing is my mouse. It's almost gone across the room and bited Lucy in the forehead on the sofa. Kind of. Oh, yeah, I've almost dashed it that far, bro. Oh, by the way, it, by the way, uh, Lucy, if you're yeah. if you're watching this right now, walk over to Blade and hit him in the back of the head. All right, go ahead. Oh, fuck's sake, bro. She did that once on a video. Side note, yes. again, she did that. We were watching one of Summer's videos, and she was like, oh, yeah, Blade's going to get hit in the back of the head when she watched it. Bro, she clapped my cheeks, bro. <laughs> she just went, I'll just clap really loudly. It's like fucking 1 a.m. Like, she fully just smacked the back of my head. I was like, what's that for? She was like, 
Summer's told me to. I'm like, <laughs> Summer's told me to. You fuck, fuck bitch. <laughs> But yeah, so R6 on top, probably yeah. CSGO and Minecraft. CSGO and Minecraft are pretty equal. Minecraft I can forever play, same as CSGO. Mm-hmm. Cold War, and then fifth game is kind of difficult because I want to say Battlefield 4, mm-hmm. just because mm-hmm. I can like, play that I, game. I, nostalgia. Yeah. Nostalgia. It's nostalgia. I grew up on that game. Yeah. Same as like Black Ops 2. So I'd, I'd say Battlefield 4 and Black Ops 2 are interchangeable for me. Yeah. You, you want to go next, uh, Kawiska? Yeah, yeah, um, I was definitely thinking about this the whole time. This is actually hard. Five games. I, I, I knew, I knew like everybody wanted to, to say something about like the, their best games because everybody yeah. has a has a top five favorite. I, I think I'm gonna go League of Legends just because I'm playing so much of it right now. I mm-hmm. really want to get good at it, mm-hmm. dude. This the skill cap in that game is so hard. high. I know oh, I'm yeah. gonna be at the top, but I want to be able to play and like always have a decent game. Mm-hmm. So definitely League of Legends. I think Apex is really close behind. Apex right now is so fun to me. Oh, the, yeah. The abilities in that game just make the possibilities endless. And well, I yeah. freaking love it. it was, it's the same thing with, like... I, would, I don't want to say Apex is the same game as Fortnite, because obviously not. But that's why Fortnite blew up, is because it was, the possibilities were endless. Well, oh, yeah. Now, yeah. now, now they peak, to... they've peaked now, but because like, no one can deci- no, knows how to... Um, 1v1 anymore because everybody knows everything but um yeah there's so many possibilities you can do a tower in the middle of bumfuck nowhere <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah uh, uh probably number three de- die or not days gone it, oh I just thought because you were dead by daylight. i was gonna say dead by daylight but i, me- I meant days gone i just because i'm streaming right now and it is so fun and i really wish i could stream it right now and i can't wait till i can finish it oh yeah uh, it's the such game's, a long game bro i'm still it's streaming so, it it's so fun it's oh so yeah big. It is so fun. It's so open world. It's like everything I want in a game. I cannot wait until Dying Light 2 comes out. I am going to absolutely grind that game so oh, yeah. hard. Oh, yeah. Um, um, yeah. Um, that three, I love that game. four. Great. <laughs> I don't even know at this point. Uh, probably <laughs> Just Yandere start naming Simulator. like two two or three more games. Yandere Simulator. Simulator? I freaking love Yandere Simulator. <laughs> if anybody's game... curious, go watch his old videos and you'll see why. Oh yeah, I've I've re- I've recorded that game so much on my channel. Like I played it so much. If you guys want to check it out, it is the funnest game. I freaking love that. And then number five, I might say Porn. Porn. like Cold War. Cold War. Cold yeah, War. I understand I, like, that. As much as I don't play it as much these days, it's always a game I can it's fall still back a vibe. on. It's it, so much. Yeah, fun. COD it's is so always a fallback game, even if it's not your favorite game. I, I feel. I that. feel but I COD's f- also like something that it doesn't change enough for me to be bad at it. If oh I yeah. Go back to oh it. yeah. It's not like R six where it, it like they changed the recoil spray because they recently did that with R six. Yeah. But like COD is always that game where if you play it once, it's like riding a bike. Like yeah, I, if, I totally agree. If with you that. play it like on the first few days of the launch, for, on for oh yeah, too. oh yeah, um, with skill, that that's skill based matchmaking for you. Yeah, skill based matchmaking, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. Feel that. Um, but what I think some training wheels. You got yeah. one, kitty. Let's put you with pros. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go backwards. Fuck it, unicycle. <laughs> I'm gonna go backwards from five to one. Number five right now is definitely Minecraft. Special comp. No, Minecraft. Really? Is Minecraft. It far back? It Minecraft is there because a, I'm, I'm 16 years old, ADHD. so I, I I played it a lot as a kid. So oh, the, me too. so the possibilities are starting to get not as endless because I've played <laughs> it for so long. But yeah. it's still it's still it will still forever be a top five game just because it it, it you the, you can play it whenever you can play it survival creative. Dude, I can mod. still play Hunger Games and still wreck kids. Trust. Yeah, um, I was never so good fun. at Hunger Games. Sky no, Wars as well. I was the best at Sky Wars. Like, if you're the best at Sky Wars in like your school, like that was like game over. Like that was the best was feeling cold. in the world. Yeah, yeah, COD was like there, but like, COD, COD was school. big in my school. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Clash of Clans. Right now we are. Um, I never played Clash of Clans. I think Clash I played... Royale was big in my school. I played as well. Clash Royale. Clash was massive. Bro. I played Clash I was, Royale in the, the first few boys. days. I was one of the top at Clash Royale, bro. How did I, I know? Yeah, not, what's this the, what's full the legendary four? BS deck, bro. Uh, number and four. It, it worked. Number four would be right now. I'm not talking about all time again. Um, right now would probably be Splitgate. Split. Just, oh really? J- I just installed it last night too, but like it's already that high up just from the fact that I don't rage at it. Like, I haven't raged at it once. Like, I know it's I played it for two days because I played it today, and I didn't rage at all. But, like, it's the game. It's a game where it's, like, similar to COD, but it's not as, like, try. It's going to get try-hardy eventually, and that's why I don't think it'll ever be, like, 
top five games I've played of all time. Not even like top 20, but still. Um, number three would probably be Apex. Apex Legends is like, like Kawiska said, like endless possibilities with those fucking like, my, my main's Octane, but so is Kawiska. So whenever I play with him, he's like, you motherfucker, you auto-locked Octane, you cunt. But um, I think number two is R6, just because R6 is like, I've pl- I had, so before I started playing with like Blade and like all these guys, I had like 200 hours in the game. Now I'm at 700. So there's obviously been a drastic change. And the reason for that is recording because sessions. just so many yeah. fucking recording sessions. And it's such a fun game. Like the I possibilities. I, like it. I hate it. Yeah. And that's fine. It, t- it takes time to love. That's the problem. Yeah. We fucking I hated it. it. Bro, the first, first, when I started playing that game, I fucking hated it. Back on, back on like, uh, when I was playing it on PS4, hated it. When I started playing it on here, I was more playing it because I wanted to have fun with my friends, yeah. less so having fun with the game. <clears throat> which, but, now which... I've used to the mechanics and the peaking, I love the game, and I'm actually starting to get good at it, and me and crew usually fight for, like, second or top place, same as Summerish. Yeah. We're starting to fight for who's in first place. Yeah, we're all starting to get when we first started in. playing, it was just me, me number one, but, like, they're starting to catch up now. Just because I, like... I, I, I don't, I don't want to say, like, I've played more games than them, but I think I've played so many FPSs in my life where I've just been like, oh, yeah, another FPS game, why not? Like a new FPS game oh, just yeah. came out, and I think yeah, I used to I used to never do FPSs, and I think mm-hmm. that's what gives me such a leg down. Well, that's and, it's, and it was also because I tried to do like I aim trained for Fortnite, like you know the aim train where you get like the bots yeah. and stuff like that. You have O2 actually, and I just realized. Um, I do also because I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like I, like I did music. like the bots, the like the circles and stuff you had to aim with, and like I feel like that just transfer transfer over to all my games just because it was like I because I had like a thousand hours or something like that on an aim trainer. Um, yeah. I have to look. I'm nerd. Fuck yeah, I off. Pro. I got like. I would got you like would you call Grizzly a nerd to his face? Would you call Grizzly yes. a nerd to his face? Yes. Fuck yes. you. Yes. Fuck, fuck, yes. fuck, yes. fuck you both. All right then. Um, but I guess number one would be um, CS:GO. CS:GO. CS:GO yeah, is I'm my. Oh yeah, you love you. CS:GO. CS:GO. I, I have three thousand hours on CS:GO. I was scared you were gonna say GTA, and I was like, dang, I didn't even think about GTA when I was doing mine. Uh, I don't think like, GTA is oh, top GTA five. Not for me. Because no. just because. Seven. GTA I takes so much time. If yeah. we got back on it and we actually started playing it again, yeah. I think. Well, I if would, someone showed I the fuck up sometimes, I think we'd be able to play it a lot more, goddamn. <laughs> you know, well, really if he true. swaps the day like, shifts, if he swaps the day shifts, oh yeah, yeah. yeah if I swap oh, the day yeah. shifts, it'd be a time. lot easier for us to do stuff. Yeah. Um, for but sure. I feel like um, CS:GO is number one because after Fortnite, I was like, okay, I know I'm good at this game. I know I'm not great at this game to where I've become a pro, but I know all the smoke spots on the maps. I know everything about the game. Top. I don't know everything about the game, but I know enough about the game where I could teach people how to play. And that's why I started uploading YouTube videos of me teaching people how to play or how to do the smoke spots or how to control recoil. And then it eventually transferred over to me playing, doing this, but I still stayed in touch with the pro community like you, you you can name a team right now in the csgo like because there's a tournament going on right now if you named most of those teams i could tell you a top five player all time in in there just because i've i've stayed in touch with it for so long and just because it's also a game that i feel like will never die but will just get older it feels like well, it, like there's a couple it's not of those just going get... on right now yeah. yeah, it's not only it will get older, but it evolves. Yeah. So well, CS:GO. Learn. Well, CS:GO Even, two comes out in twenty twenty three or twenty twenty four. Yeah. Well, games like that evolve, and I don't mean in necessarily the actual physical game. Yeah, they'll add a gun, like the MP five, for example, got added. I can't remember when it was so fucking long ago. Yeah. But they'll add a gun, or they'll change something very fucking minor that yeah. no one will ever know. Which it's, it's just a tweak that's a bug, like a hole in the wall. Yeah. But like people themselves will evolve like the way they move the way they play fucking straight down to like counting in their head so I, they know roughly I, how far things go i fucking hate if you're like if you're a person like this go fuck yourself but um i'm talking to my the people watching if you go on twitter and be like i don't know how csgo is a game all you gotta do is point and click, kiss my Fuck round off. ass. You you uh. you cannot tell me that when I literally saw Stewie 2K jump through a smoke the other day and kill five guys. Like yeah, that, I, I saw, I'm pretty sure I saw, saw the same clip. Yeah, like dude, like CS:GO is such a game is such a good game because there isn't so many changes where it like 
you can't, you have to learn something new. There's no meta in the game. It's been the same game for like the last like ten years or something like that. It, it, no, it hasn't been game, ten. That game takes skill. Yeah, that game actually because it's because back in the day when the game was out, they didn't have like um a way to make random spray patterns. So like COD, they have a randomized spray pattern, so it doesn't always just go straight up or straight diagonal. It, it will divert depending because yeah. the computer will randomize your bullets each time, give or take. Mm -hmm. So in that respect, sometimes it can be luck. Like Fortnite, for example, their spray on their shotgun is completely luck. Like, because you can crack someone's head or you can hit all their body. That's I'm, I remember that from fucking ages ago. But like CSGO, if I still remember correctly, with the AK is an upside down T. Upside upside down T. Yeah. Like the way the spray pattern is, because they had to physically mark out spray patterns. Yeah. Because back then spray patterns yeah, they couldn't just have randomized ones. They had to have fixed ones. So it takes skill to learn how the gun moves. It's kind of like Valorant as well. Valorant has somewhat fixed uh yeah. spray well, patterns. Well that's why Valorant got yeah, so good. Left, yeah, the left and the right may change each time, but that's as much as it is. The yeah. up and the down is the same. It also gave There's three like, games that I yeah. don't think are going to die ever in my lifetime. What's that? One, CSGO. I don't, I don't yes. think it will. I, I, I think CS2, CSGO 2 is going to come out, and everyone's going to go back to CS, CSGO. Once, yeah. Once I feel, the well, there's still people playing CS, CS 1.6. Like, that's how... And then, yeah. and then League of Legends. No one can deny. I can't. Like no, League of Legends constantly gets updated. I can't, yeah. I can't say nothing about League of Legends. Dying. League of Legends Not is my game. insane. They're adding new characters still yeah. when the game came out in, like, 2007 or 2008 or something like that. Maybe, yeah. uh, one of my friends earlier. play it, and he's been playing it since launch, and he religiously is, plays that fucking it game. Yeah. Such, it is such I a think fun game if you get into it. There's some people yeah. who like, there's a lot of people have that one game that like will never die, and I, I feel like for me that would be CSGO. Because yeah, yeah. CS, because like, I've watched so many people, like for example, like the way I found Happy was, um, I know none of you guys know this, um, I think I might have told crew and like, but um, the way I found happy was is that he had a small semi pro team. Then it was like, it, but it was only like the only people that were on that night were him and one other dude. And I, we, it, there's this thing called Face It. Face It is where pro league mat. Pro, it, it's basically like semi pros come and just be do, do fabulous. And I wasn't doing great at it, but I was all right at it. And it was a and there's a paid version, there's a free version. Obviously, I was on the free version cuz I'm a broke fuck. Anyways, they were on the free version as well. And um I get in there and Happy Happy's a fucking savant at this game. He has done the research to be Bro, he's he, broken. He like Happy's me and him broken. like I, like me, him, like me, you, and crew always have this like battle to fight at the number one spot. If Happy is trying his ass off at CS:GO, there's no oh, like me and him fight. I will no, I will get nowhere near him. He dropped 25 kills in five rounds. I had 14. That's amazing for me. Happy was like, eh, I can do better than this. And he ended up getting like 37 oh, kills in like two more rounds or some shit. Or not two more rounds, yeah. in like 10 more rounds. Happy's that is broken. crazy shit. Like I was playing with him on that, on, on that game, the Face It game. He called out every single place the other team was going to go every single time. We knew exactly where they were going to go. Because Happy, Happy could yeah, Happy yeah, memorized a that player's head. Games like that. Yeah, Happy memorized the player's head and basically was like, I know exactly where they're going to go because through this smoke over here and they're going to go on the opposite side of the map, run back over, then go back to that opposite side. And I'm like, that's fucking amazing. And he was like, but you're but like that game I was just getting lucky and he was having like really bad luck and I was doing better than him. So much so to the point where he was like, Hey, do you wanna be a um do you wanna have a spot in our team? And I was like, nah man, I'm a content creator. I just I shit post pretty much, man. And he's like, All right, do you wanna sub in for us whenever we needed like a sub in? Which sub in is basically where if someone got sick or couldn't make the tournament that day, I would be the add on pretty much. I would be the guy who's like, Hey, let's go, I can do it. Um, with no practice, and like I can't get blamed because I don't practice with them. So I was like, hell yeah, man, I'll be a sub in. And um, I remember uh, there was this one tournament they had. Nobody but me and him showed up, and me and him basically just went to play 
fucking CS um like pubs for like two hours, and he's like, "You're funny," and I'm like, "You're funny," and he's like, "Okay, let's have." Um, and so then we have haven't. Kids. Let's have kids. Let's get married. <laughs> yeah, let's, yeah, let's fuck. <laughs> but yeah, but that's after. But that was how we met, and we haven't stopped recording since. And so, <laughs> Wanna yeah. share anal beats? <laughs> Oh, and you take that World and I'll take this and pull. World of Warcraft. I never, I didn't finish that. World of Warcraft. Oh yeah, you didn't. You said I, three. I never got game. into that. I hate that game. I got into I RuneScape. Can't deny it's massive. I got into RuneScape, bro. That was I mean, really I'm mad. Oh, old school RuneScape is I where I that. can sit for hours. I could be, I could be staring at the screen. My character can just be mining, and I could be running backwards and forwards from a bank for like twelve hours. I'm happy. Y'all ever heard of Wizard 101? Y'all ever heard of Wizard 101? Actually, yeah, my friend plays it. I hate Wizard 101. Just yeah, yeah, it's it's a shitty game. That's why it was a piece of shit game. I still played it for like five hours. I couldn't with those games. Yeah, I couldn't. This Scum Podcast is sponsored by the Scum members, so youtube.com slash bladesync, youtube.com slash kawiska, and youtube.com slash c slash summers, since some bitch already took my summers URL. But um, what is something that you would like want to do, but what is, something, what is something you want to end up doing one day, whether it be going snorkeling, having like your, having your own dream house, what is it? Um, having a kid? I, I guess I'll go. Yeah, you go. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna flip houses. That's what I wanna do. Wait, I didn't like hear along, I wanna do it alongside of YouTube, but like I wanna flip houses. Oh, you wanna flip houses? Like, wanna, oh, yeah, flip, flip houses. houses! I was like, yeah. you, I, it oh. sounded like happened to him. Like that's how, that's how what it sounded like to me. I was like, can you say that one wanna, more time? Flip houses. Yeah, I wanna do that. I, I, flip houses. I, I've always wanted to. It's been so, it's always been like in the back of my head, and then I'm just like, I would love to do that eventually. Yeah, I, I wanna do it alongside YouTube, and honestly, I've always thought about like filming it. While yeah. I do it. Yeah. That w- that's not a, such a bad you idea. Put that as like a different channel. Like Whisker Renovates or something. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's actually a small well, that, idea. Like that would be something that's different. That would like not, not like so, there's probably somebody who does that. Yeah. yeah but there's not a likely. ton of people who do that. Yeah. And I could probably do it better. Uh, I'm not saying better, but like I like my personality better you could, than most You people, could so. do it and still and still have that audience that yeah, you yeah, have. Yeah. Um, do you. Okay. I have I have another question, but go ahead, Blade. I don't I don't want to cut you guys off. Mine mine was what I said. Oh, kids. you want to have a kid crew? Oh, what I about have you? A job that's, yeah, no, on a real. I've been staring at kids. Uh, Lucy's petrified of this, but I'm probably oh, one of the rarest males that actually enjoys talking about kids mm-hmm. and having oh, kids. Oh, we must be brothers. My girlfriend's like, bro, out my mom, my I'm mom's like having a baby, and I am, I'm literally, I'd be like, I want that. That's so cute. I like over too. my mom's baby stuff, bro. And I'm so sad. Welcome, Summers, to adulthood. Um, you got this to look forward to. Fuck, man. I fucking hate the fact I'm the oldest cunt in this. Yeah, Summer, right we're now. gonna have kids together. Are you happy? I'm leaving this. I'm. I, I'm. I'm. Le- I drop out of scum. I drop out of scum. Blades the new hit leader. I'm out. I'm done. Uh, fuck that. I don't want to be in f- charge of fucking crew because then he's gonna try and show me his fucking nudes. I'm good. Um, <laughs> gotta no, edit that out, you dick. We have a kids. Um, no, nah, it's fine. Whatever. What the fuck is he doing in the corner? Yeah, I just want to be happy. But no, I want. Uh, well, well, do I you? Want my you want to be a Dairy Queen? I just want my Dairy Queen. <laughs> just my Dairy Queen. I want to own a Dairy Queen no, one day. I just want to feel mine something. To live... <laughs> I want yeah, to feel something. Live comfortably. Live comfortably. Don't, don't, yeah, yeah. don't. You don't have to worry about debt. Live. live com- yeah, live comfortably. Don't worry. Really have to worry about money too much. Yeah. Have a job I enjoy, which is editing right now, which is slowly going on. Yeah, you told me Thank that. God. You told me that was like the that you that was your dream job. That wasn't originally so your dream I had job. Two. Yeah, so I had two. Originally, it was to do YouTube, and then the reason I went to do YouTube is because I have a passion to edit and I enjoy editing. But the other one was obviously to join the military due to medical things of my family's medical history. I couldn't do it. Um, which most people probably know if they follow me. Yeah, um, yeah. I've told it why. before. I've told I, I have it, I've I've said it on videos. Whisker's before. Whiskers coming in the fucking corner, bro. He's looking like me half this recorded uh, half this podcast. Oh my god! Uh, but the, the genuine one is to to probably have a kid. A kid. Um. Yeah, and have like a family built mm-hmm. up when, in a few years. So what about you? And by a few years, I mean oh. like thirty, bro. Okay. Nowhere, nowhere near. Okay. I mean like stable enough that I can provide that kid. Yeah. A life I definitely didn't have. Okay. Yeah, that sounds good. Crew, what about you? I mean, oh, it would be, uh, us, bro. Pr- pretty cool to, like, do music shit or probably get big off, like, uh, 
uh, mm-hmm. internet shit, like internet entertainment. But like at this point, yeah, I just I just want to feel like. <laughs> Oh, I, I kind of relate. <laughs> I, <need help. laughs> I don't want to feel love. That's why Dairy Queen is the only thing that still loves me. Yo, Dairy Queen kind of thing in life that only Yo, Sonic's a blast. Right, oh, our Sonic got closed down. I won't get back on food. They failed every single <laughs> health, <laughs> health, health test. Oh, That's yeah. Bad. Same here. They, the one just closed down, like, up the street from me. Yeah, Dairy Queen took over their spot. <laughs> yeah, what a... So, crew's been, been happy. I have a Dairy Queen here. Near yeah, me, near me, we do. Oh yeah! If anybody I'm doesn't, if anybody Quisca. doesn't realize, me and Kaliska <laughs> live in the same state now. We live in the same house. He's yeah, they can touch. For me. Yeah, they can touch toast. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, shut the out, fuck up down there. The I'm living here for free, rent free. Yeah. Oh yeah. Mind, oh yeah. And in his bed. Oh yeah. Um, but <laughs> something. <laughs> so, <laughs> which is a great transition to what I want to say next is that I want to be able to um, I want to be able to. No. Um. There's two things I want. There's two things I want to do. I want to be able. To not have to listen to anyone. So, for example, YouTube is oh, like the first. Oh, you don't want to listen to me, motherfucker. <laughs> no, I don't want to have a boss. I don't want to have someone yeah. telling me what to do. So, YouTube is like the number one thing. But like being on top of like a graphic designing cl- team, maybe having my own business oh, as a graphic designer. So um, something like that is like something that I really want to do because like I feel like the goal in life is to not have is to be able to say fuck all of you i think that's like the number one goal in life is just to be like i worked that. my ass off so now I, I i can be like 60 and i don't have to listen to a fuck uh yeah fucking yeah. topic at all um i want to be like i want to be like 30 and not have to listen to a single oh yeah oh yeah that's like the dream but like yeah. you know it's people say it's unlikely and i that's what i always tell them is like whenever I'm someone says that yeah. yeah i just want like that, yeah, it's, that's it's what, unlike, that's the thing. It's is, only unlikely to people that don't want it. If you yeah. want or it, don't you already have it, it, or don't already have that, yeah. so there'd be yeah. fifteen still listening to a boss. But um, yeah. the other thing I want is just if you to want be something. You'll push for it. No oh yeah, fucking who's in front of you? Yeah, yeah, totally, totally. Um, the other, the only other thing I want is just to be able to like actually meet you guys in real life. To like, so for example, uh, let's say yeah. there's like a pack I down. I want a poke crew. <laughs> you want a what? Man, man disappear. Yeah, you know that Michelin man. You know, if like you poke the Michelin man, he'll just like start flying everywhere, like air out. Why yeah. do I expect anything else than just like a fucking verbal assault? Bro, you want to pull on my hair? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you want to pull on my hair and call me your bitch? Shut the fuck up. No, I don't. Any, any, anyways, anyways. Um, but yeah, I want to be able to like yeah, meet. I want to. I want to be able to like meet like. Especially, I want to meet like someone who's a fan of the channel who isn't like a troll oh. in real life or something like that. I want to actually be oh, able to like cool. sh- stick my hand out and shake his hand and be like, "How's your day?" And, and he yeah. and he'll, how does my dick taste hand. in your mouth? All right, all right. Um, okay, here's my here's <laughs> one of the last kind of question. Here's the one. Oh. Here's one of the last questions we're gonna ask. At what number of subscribers would you drop everything and do YouTube? Like, at what number would it have to be? I've already done that, technically speaking. Okay. It's focusing on you personally already do it okay let's say you blew up to a certain number like the minimum number and you said fuck it and just quit editing for logan because from now on you you'll uh, have enough I money think, i don't think i'd stop editing for logan necessarily because for 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 me logan's like become more of like it's more of like a friendship more than just a job now well at this point it's like, like a father figure. don't say that cut this part out guys we can't he's no, gonna no, stop no, no, j- j- stop no. <laughs> He, he, he paid me fucking yesterday. It was like July. I was like, shit, I forgot about that payment. Um, <laughs> fucking remind me of paying me. I was like, shit, I forgot you needed to pay me and you paid me. Sweet. <laughs> um, but what's it called? Like, I don't think I'd ever stop editing for Logan. Mm-hmm. I just think I'd stop editing for people that I'm not close to. Uh-huh. Like, if you're just explaining to me, I won't edit for you. But like, if you're genuinely my friend and I'm editing for you and I work for you, then yeah, I don't think I'd stop it. But I think I'd use it as like an extra source of income, if that makes sense. So even like if YouTube, you had like a million subscribers, yeah, I think I think YouTube would then become my main source, and then I'd probably not outsource some, like I'd outsource some of my editing, not all of it. I'd still keep some of it for myself, but I'd outsource maybe some of the more boring stuff, or not boring, but more of the stuff I don't want to do. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. like for instance, R six. I enjoy editing R six right now. Oh yeah, and I'd probably outsource. Minecraft maybe or CS CS:GO cuz I enjoy those videos but like I really enjoy at NR6. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and that makes sense. What so about I you? That's, that's what I'd more do. What about you, Kaliska? I don't know if there's a certain amount of subscribers. <laughs> so like, I think views. I think views I would probably Yeah, consistent go, views. If I was getting consistently 
around a K, like 1,000. So, if, like, let's say, for example, let's say you got 70K tomorrow. Oh, if you, yeah, if, if you were and, getting... And, you, and, you, and all, your, all your views and all your videos shot up to, like, 10,000, something like that. I don't even need 10,000. I'm saying, like, every one of my videos, like, every, every time I post, if I get 1,000... Like, in the first, like, I mean, hour? Yeah, I'm saying, well, like, yeah, like... If you have a good CPM. Yeah. I'm talking, you, like, right away, like, you, I post that, and I'm guaranteed within that, like, the first, like, I don't know. If, let's say let's say five hours because usually five hours is yeah a good okay we'll say, we'll say that yeah we'll yeah. Say that. yeah like just a thousand mm -hmm. like i know i'm not going to be making probably really anything there yeah but you'd make a couple hundred you think so yeah you well, would the, you would so make you, you would make enough to pay rent after I experience it. you wouldn't make enough to pay rent i would think i I, you depending I mean, on how much you if, like, if you I know. made enough to do that to pay every bill yeah let, even for, if it was like uh, like barely I think I would be fine yeah if you uploaded yeah. like every other day and got like let's say like five thousand views in a day I think you would be yeah. enough to like live off of and then you would just grow mm -hmm. from there you'd, but like yeah you'd be plus, able to the thing is I also have so many videos already posted I went for a year posting daily yeah I have so many yeah. videos in my history that if I were to make it big now. Those videos that I have now would would make Which, the, like yeah they would, would start, start getting traction yeah would start yeah. getting traction and making me money as well. So me getting a thousand views in this video is what I'm saying. I'm yeah. getting a thousand views in my in my video like averaging a thousand. Yeah. Those people are then going to go watch my old videos. Whether yeah. it gets recommended or they look for yeah. it, like it's going to roll, and then that's going to end up rolling into consistently a thousand is going to end up being consistently fifteen hundred, consistently two thousand, consistently twenty five hundred. You know, it's going to like. It's gonna start rolling, but like that's that's what I'm thinking right now. I think the least Mine would just be pay bills, yeah. Yeah, I think the yeah. least amount of subscribe. Like honestly, like that's the that's the thing with every like YouTuber who has like 60k. That a lot of them don't like go out. Like none of them. Like a lot of them just need to pay rent and pay for food, and that's it. And pay for like upgrades. Oh yeah, I don't yeah. go out whatsoever. That's the thing. I don't, is that, I don't have to work. Yeah, I. I'm happy. I'm. I need to worry, but I'm not. Um, but <laughs> you don't need to worry, yet, bro. Yeah, I know. But um, I feel like the number one thing with me is just being able to, like, being able to think I have financial security. Even if, like, I don't, for example, let's say I'm, like, scraping by for food. Like, let's say I have to pay, like, 10 bucks for food every day. I feel like if I, if I felt like my channel would Somewhere. grow enough, um, if my channel would grow enough to the point where I think it would gr – I know it would grow – like if I did the math in my head, yeah, which, I'm, which I'm which I'm shit at math. Like that, yeah. well, well, I'm already uploading regularly. I don't think I would. Eat, I would. The only time I would like, I think I would only do like every four days. I don't think I would go any higher than that, just because I don't think it'd be worth it. And I also don't like uploading daily. I burned out so hard, bro. See? Yeah, I did as well. Yeah, yeah and that, and that's what I'm afraid of. A year plus of just daily. Yeah, and it I feel like and I feel like doing daily. Mm -hmm. Isn't the editing style? No offense to both either of you, but that's not the editing style I oh, like. I, I fully agree. What there a was team. a point where I was going hard. Like editing was like my favorite thing. So I like I record the game. Yeah, yeah, that was that. I would make all of my comedy and stuff through the editing, and yeah. like I was posting that daily. Oh my gosh, that was the hardest time well, of my life. You. I I remember. So I did a similar thing at the start. I was doing like I'd say reasonably good edits for like how much i was posting but i noticed during towards the end it say this is quality and this is quantity it just started doing this you think and so? then all of a sudden i but for me personally all of a sudden i burnt out mm. and i was like no i can't do this anymore and i just i just stopped posting for a little while and i kind of just disappeared and then obviously i met the boys for people to know my history and then like i was still daily edit, uh daily posting then but then i started more posting like every other day to like once a week sometimes and the quality just went like that immediately yeah. and i start i also gained subs like crazy as well mm -hmm. there was this like, thing that's how i shot to a thousand subs so you know they always say like play one game because that's what like if you play one game then you build the fan base on that game you know i have I've, I, I've seen that actually i have seen that because when mm -hmm. i was i was i was playing yandere simulator for like three weeks straight fans were coming in they were commenting on the videos they were telling me things to do like they would give me challenges and stuff like that it was doing really well but the thing is, is I, I i'm not a one game kind of guy i don't know why i can't play one game forever so when i started getting burnt out of that game i was like what am i supposed to do 
Like, do yeah. I do I keep playing this game and not have any fun, or do I go and play something that's like? And I think, and I think that's the know. anxiety that kills YouTubers. I think oh, that. Yeah, yeah, I can feel that. I can well, feel that's that, why yeah. Jack Sebdekai hasn't uploaded in three months. It's because he literally only played like Subnautica because that Didn't was getting him. Just record with the sideman. Jack That was Ali. That was Ali. No, yeah, I was just no, saying. Jack yeah, yeah. uploaded like a week ago, but it was like him talking to himself, for, like a little short film. And then three months ago, he he uploaded like a little short film. Uh, like I was actually an eleven minute short film of like how he felt the past fifteen months after his like dad died. Which that motherfucker does not deserve the hate he gets. I just want to throw that out there right now. That motherfucker saved a lot of kids' childhoods and blah blah blah. Mm. Um, but I feel like that's what kills YouTubers and a lot of YouTubers is just the fact that yeah. I can't, I don't know how to make the fans happy and I'm too afraid to ask the fans what they want. Yeah, yeah. I, I respect people who are like, I'm going to do what the fuck I want. Like right now I'm doing whatever I want. Yeah. Blade. Like I, 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 I do whatever they change. want and make it work. I was going to say, I'm doing whatever I want, but I feel like if I don't you think still feel closed, you still feel closed personally to like a certain type of thing. Yeah, I, I could, feel I like, definitely feel I that. I feel like that's like why I don't if like for example like if my if I post like one Minecraft video and it got like 10,000 views out of nowhere because like I guess someone reacted to it that was big or something like that. I feel like I still wouldn't upload only Minecraft, but in the back of my head I'd be thinking maybe you should upload Minecraft. It would get you more views and stuff like that. Yeah, that's that's how I was with the other yeah. I was like, maybe I should go back to that because I, I got I got like ten less views on this video. Maybe I should go that back to that. Life. Yeah, yeah. That's how, and that's why. And after watching, I I don't want to say names here, but after seeing how many people went to wobbly live videos, yeah, I noticed I, my channel blew up. I've got ten k views on one of my videos, easy, and it it's still gaining views right now. When I just checked. It has 200 views today. Mm -hmm. Like, it's just going up and up and up and up. And there, that's a video from, like, November. Yeah, I've, I've seen that. The, the older videos, for some reason, I had a gun game uh, Cold War video that was before gun game was on in Cold War. So hey, I'm gonna I, take a did, piss, I did a challenge where, like, you, you go, shot, where if, like, I shot someone with this gun, I would switch to the next class, you know, and I would use that, and I would use that, and I would, I would try to do it within that full game. And... I was doing that, and I I tried it in the last time, but it didn't end up working out. I kind of rage quit or whatever. I wasn't as good as I was at call at Cold War, so I finished that and I posted it, and it did the average views. I think it had like one seventy five views, and then about a month or two later, it just started going up, and I seen it hit a thousand views, and I was like, what the heck? Because I seen it in my most popular videos yeah. of the of the week, and I was like, what what the heck? And then I woke back the next day, and it was at two thousand views, and I'm like, yeah, I'm blowing up, I'm blowing up. <laughs> I, was, I was getting excited. I, I think I have like. 10, 10, or 10, 000 view, or 100,000 views on the channel, yeah. which is insane because I don't think I have a single video yeah. over 10, 10K views. I don't, I don't have a single mm -hmm. video. That's just how many videos I've posted. Yeah, all my Wobbly Life videos have um, hit, uh, like hit, starting to hit past 5K. Like yeah, yeah. easy past 5K. Some of them almost hitting 10K with the... It was an Easter egg video. That was what it was. I posted an Easter egg video when there was no Easter egg videos. Yeah. So... I even did it recently. Recently, I posted an updated one because mm -hmm. I was like, fuck it. So many people are asking me for an updated Easter egg video on this game. I'll do it. I did it, and now that one, what it's doing is it's starting to do this. The yeah. old one is still getting views, but the new one's starting to catch up, and the old one's starting to drop down. Yeah. Like, And the retention time on it, it's like a 20-minute video, and the retention time is 99%. Uh, I'm that's like, good. well, shit. Yeah. It's, it's got so many watch hours on it. It's just it's broken. Yeah, um, old, old, sometimes old videos just skyrocket. I'm not. This is just how it works. Yeah, and I after why, and I'm throwing a lot of shade here, and I just want to say this really quickly. I if whoever you're thinking I'm throwing shade at, it's not the right person. All I'm gonna say. Um, but what I'm saying is, is that there's crew. He's talking track on crew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yep, all, all on crew. Those wobbly but... life videos are finally catching up to me. <laughs> Just say it. No, 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 no say I'm not gonna it. say the name because it's gonna get me in some yeah. shit. And it's also I don't yeah. hate. I don't. I don't hate the dude. I don't hate the dude. It's right, the. What you're say, yeah. It's the fact that um this person wanted to like force me to play these games that he thought would help my channel grow, and didn't want me playing only FPSs. He thought it would kill my channel. Dead fucking opposite of what happened. 
I'm gaining subs more than I gain subs while playing the games he wanted me to play. And yeah, the you're getting subs faster than I am. Yes. You, got to, you just gotta, you gotta do you. I know. And, oh, and like this, at, and like he, he was always being a jackass t towards me because he wanted to like be like, oh, you're not, your channel is not gonna grow, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, look at it now. Like, yeah, it's yeah. growing more than like, you those games would ever help me and i don't w and i don't want to mean to sound like oh i'm i fucking hate this dude or something like that i don't but at the same fucking time i I've, I've been just i haven't said anything about it and i want to say something about it now because it's been such a fucking piece of shit thing in my head so that's all i'm going to say is that i'm not i'm not i'm not going to upload games that other people want me to do and i'm going to upload games what the fuck i want to do and so if it's CSGO, if it's Minecraft, if it's fucking Gary's mod, if I'm going to be, if I'm going to do whatever I want to fucking do. And if people don't like it, get the fuck off my channel. That's all I'm going to say. On, on that note, we are creeping up on two hours now. So yeah, yeah I, think that's, I, say, I think that's, um, yeah. I think that's, I think, um, uh, shit thoughts. What, what's one of the weirdest thoughts you've had while taking a shit? Don't let my ring fall off my hand. Oh no, that Whiska. reference. This thing ridiculous is purple. God damn it. <laughs> Whiska, weirdest thought you've had while taking a shit. Go. <laughs> that that was the thought. That 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 was the thought. That, that was the thought. Fuck <laughs> that was the thought. I'm fucking done. Okay. We're right. done. We're done. Right. Thank, <laughs> thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this I'm podcast done. and you made I'm it done. this far, fuck knows how you made it. Summer's pissed. Oh, there's a ah manual focus subtitles. If you made it this far, thank you for watching. I hope you did enjoy it. My name's Blade Sync. That's Kawiska. I don't know where I'm pointing because I don't see the overlay. Uh, Kawiska's right here. Much. Yep, Summerish, crew in the corner, the guy that's been eating the entire session. I ate a cucumber oh, and enjoyed it. If you made it uh, made it this far, thank you. Like, hey, make sure to check out everyone's channels. Oh, yeah, yeah. Every, uh, all yeah, the channels are going to be in the, the, the description. Yeah, that's, that's tagged. Don't worry. Yeah, they're, they're tagged. They're in the they're description. Tagged. Go check us out on TikTok. Um, yeah, we're going to have that. Twitter, Instagram. Uh, the Twitter, Instagram uh, is made. We need to add me on uh, kick. Kick. <laughs> Y'all remember that shit? No, no, join me in my streams. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to stay frosty. Use cruise, use cruise <laughs> referral code on dairyqueen.com when, when you order your use next meal. Use all your insults on me right now. Uh, work. <laughs> uh, full disclosure, it doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Have a good day, people. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. Bye.